Good after um what am I saying? Did I just say good afternoon? I meant uh, good midnight, everyone. <laughs> Chill up, 07 here. <laughs> and today we're gonna play Pokemon Platinum Nuzlocke Plus. So last time we had to go to Rally Windworks, but we got shut off, and we have to go backtrack to uh, Floramora Town, and to go to where the two grunts were standing at. And I don't think we can get past there. Yeah. I mean, I'll talk to them. What do you say? We think that they're conducting research in Eternal Forest. This is as far as you go. Our research involves catching Pokemon in the flowery meadows of Flormora. We're also covertly stealing the energy of the Valley Windworks. Yeah. Actually, I am concerned, so you don't have to say that. Anyways, before we go any further, this is my team here. We have level 18 Moonshake with Tackle, Double Team, Quick Attack. Attack. Uh, Genshi, you level 16. Tackle, Leer, um, Charge, and Spark. Uh, Lobby at level 19 with Metal Claw, Growl, Bubble Beam, and Pack. Uh, Leafy, level 16 with Absorb, Growth, Mega Drain, and Stun Bar. Uh, Roxanne, level 16 with Rock Throw, Defense Curl, Magnitude, and Rock Polish, and HM Slave. Alright, so this is our entire team. We have a full team this time. I'm surprised. Well, it's probably because we caught a lot of Pokemon, and we gained access to Valley Windworks. What? No way, you have the key? Locking the door with meanliness. I am the loser in this after all. This is no time for self-pity, I have got to alert the commander. You do that. <laughs> Anyways, I'm charging right in front. Uh-oh. We're fighting against those grunts. Oi, this is no funs and games. This is proper work, I tell you. Okay, let's get down to business then. What do you have? You only have one Pokemon. It's a Zubat. I'm gonna knock it out in one hit. <laughs> so yeah, I've been grinding for about 2-3 to three hours before I continue playing. Have to defeat all those level 9 enemies, which is gonna take a little bit while to level up to the levels that I want. What? Some brass, some brat messed up with my job. Uh-oh. Too bad. I am gonna skip you, so I'm gonna challenge her. Okay, um, let's see. I'm gonna put Luppy in front because it's, um, because it's probably bulky. Let me check. 32, 37. Yeah, Piplup's overall, overall bulky, but Roxanne is bulky on the physical side, too, so I guess I could use both. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's do this. I'm one of Team Galactic's three commanders. No wait, that's one of four commanders. My name is Mars. We've been trying to create a new world that's better than this one, but people have shown little understanding about what we do. You don't understand either, do you? It's a little saddening. So let's have a battle to decide what we should do next. If I win, you leave. If you win, we Team Galactic will leave. Oh, okay. I agree to your ridiculous terms. What do you got there? You got a Zubat again. I guess most of the evil organization teams probably can have at least a poison type or a flying type or um, those commoners. Uh, you, you have toxic? Wow! You're kidding me! And we outspeed, it's probably because of the quick claw. Oh, Luffy's been badly poisoned, that kind of sucks. And you have Perugly. Oh, goodness. Goodness gracious, level 17. That's that's a little bit too early for a evolution like this Pokemon. I mean, Glamio couldn't evolve into level 40. Okay, we're gonna um, switch into Roxanne because it can uh, resist normal type attacks unless you have faint attack. Oh, speaking of faint attack, don't you dare have faint attack. Yes, you do, you have faint attack! Oh, but it does, it does no damage. Little to no damage. We got no problem here. I I think it's too slow for rock polish. Let's go for magnitude. Magnitude six. Um, that's uh, what is it? Fifty base power. Not bad. Seventy base power. Oh, not even bad. Oh, you have a healing item. <laughs> Magnitude 7, okay, consistent, 70 base damage, and I better heal because what if I get a critical hit? That would have been terrible. Mm 
Okay, let's go for magnitude again. Magnitude 8, that's 90 base power. And a critical hit. Something we don't need because we already finished them off. Why does every time I landed a critical hit, a critical hit that is um that is like a finishing move? It's like adding insult to the chances. <laughs> Oops, I messed that one up. That's all right though. I quite enjoy our battle. My my, lose your child, will you? But no matter. We collected plenty of electricity. With the power we obtain, we can do something quite spectacular. Uh, there's a that's probably another insignificant commander. But there should be just three commanders there. But yeah, everything's good except for Primplup being poisoned. I mean, Zubat can can actually use Toxic. It's like a TM move. I'm surprised. I thought I thought I thought the Pokemon that they have is probably gonna have um um attacks that are from their level up movesets but i guess they added a little, little bit of twist here and i better i better use an antidote like right now and even if even if i didn't in the in this generation onwards whenever i reach um, one hit point remaining the poison goes away by itself and there's looker Ah, uh, yes, it is you, yes. I've heard that the Team Galactic appeared at this power plant. I have come running. So the Team Galactic, where are they? You have run them off, you say. Your trainer, but... Very well, I shall go investigate inside. You do that. Oh, I'm gonna have to wait for him. Magnificent, yes it is. What have you said? What have you said is all true. Though you're young, you're a trainer through and through. I shall pursue the culprits. Okay, Eterna City. So that's where we must go. Okay. And I guess we can encounter Pokemon here. I mean, I could have done it by fishing, but um, it's going to be Magikarp all over again, isn't it? Yeah, we can't even um, catch better Pokemon than Magikarp there. Anyways, first Pokemon we get encountering this route is some of them that we have already encountered. I should have checked Bulbapedia to see which Pokemon are available, but looks like I don't have the device with me. I don't have my iPhone with me. Okay, turn your face around. Yes! There we go. <laughs> we got an X special defense. We can't even use X items, so it's still worthless to me. Okay, turn your face around. Good! We can avoid you! Haha. <laughs> oh, we can avoid almost anyone here. Oh! I should have waited. Oh well. There's no holding anything back. Damn straight. <clears throat> what do you have? A match off. We should be used to it now. <laughs> Can we use Bubble Beam? And it does a decent damage. Oh, I thought that was a critical hit. And we use Peck. There we go. Finish match up off with a critical hit. And again, what is up with critical hits landing on my finishing move? Like. <laughs> You only need it at full health. <laughs> I think they're just trolling me. I think they are. Those critical hits means nothing to me anymore. I mean, it does mean to me if um if I'm gonna get injured or something. Let me check if my healing items. See if I don't have more than five. Oh, I got five super potions. Let's use that on. I don't know what am I gonna use it on. I don't need. I don't think I need to use any more potions because the upcoming forest. There's always gonna be a um. NPC trainer that heals you every time after the battle ends. Oh, and she has a Piplup too. How nice. Unfortunately, my attacks have been resisted. I mean, Metal Claw can't do damage. Bubble Beam can't, so... Wow, that does nothing. You're gonna use Peck too. We'll just Peck back and forth. What about Bubble Beam? Darn it, I thought it could do more. And your speed fell, wow. <laughs> Insignificant. <laughs> what about Metal Claw? Why doesn't Piplop learn Metal Claw? I guess, I guess because its fins are too soft. It's not sharp at all. Okay, so let's gonna get that item down there and see what it is. Oh snap, it's, <sighs> darn it. Can't have more than uh more than five healing items, so we have to throw that out. J 
There's too many picking up and tossing away. Actually, berries are, um, you can't have, I forgot to include that in part of the rules, but you can't have more than five of, the, um, five of each berry. What about you? You have a, oh, it's a heal ball, okay. We use it to catch. A Pokemon, we feel like it's not gonna take, um, okay, good, that's, those facial parts are predictable. <laughs> I guess I can battle a few more trainers here. Oh. I lost my way here of all places. Don't you have a map of some sort? Or a town map? Would have been a lot easier for you. Oh, you have a huge giant snake Pokemon, Onyx. Size, size doesn't matter. <laughs> Only numbers does. We probably didn't need that critical hit, but yeah. It's always welcome though. Actually, I have enough time, three more minutes to do battle, so I'm gonna battle the hiker down there. There's no mountain here, but I'm dressed to hike. Okay. It doesn't have to be a mountain, it can be in the grassy plains. <laughs> Oh yeah, the gym leader's ace on the second gym is 22, and I can only allow Pokemon to have up to level 27. If it reaches level 28, I'm going to have to make Pokemon have the Trot ability by itself, or manually, so I can waste a turn doing nothing. So yeah, I don't. I hope I don't have to go through this mess. <laughs> Wow, you have a lot of rock type Pokemon. You're gonna give me so many uh, defense effort values. Is it a level up? It sure is. Wait, 57 hit points. Um, oh no, 57. Yeah, 57, 65, 120. 20, 175 oh wow, Empoleon's not gonna have 300 hit points at level 100, unfortunately. It's gonna be ended up at 285, I believe. Which is still okay, I mean, I don't care about its uh, um, individual values as, um, as much. Oh well, I should stop ranting about stats. <laughs> but stats are important to the game, though. Hello, my name's Cheryl, and you are? My name's Vince. I'm sincerely glad to meet you. May I ask a big favor of you? I want to get through this forest, but I'm afraid of doing it alone. I heard that there's a sinister group of people called Team Galactic about. I think there'll be safety numbers. Okay, we're gonna go with Cheryl. And we still haven't used up an encounter for that um, route before because... Oh. Because um, there's Pokemon that we probably already encounter and it's probably not worth anything. But may, what about the forest? Actually, I'll save catching um, Pokemon in the forest for the next episode. We are really running out of time, so I'm gonna end it right here. Alright, so thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.